I'm working on some really subtle changes now to kind of make this asteroid again feel more alive and more interesting. Let me show you here what I'm working on. Let me see if you can actually tell when we're just going through this first section here. Um, can you see the difference? So what I did actually, I'll zoom into the area uh, that I was mainly working on. I started messing with this idea of painting objects and painting crystals into my environment. So as I zoom in here, you can see there's some crystals here in the starting area. Uh, they're kind of red. They really have a low emission. And, and I found this crystal set. You can see down there, there's four of them uh, for free on CG Trader. So super cool. It's called Crystal Metal if you want to go look those up. And all I did is I drastically changed what it looks like. You can see this one here is kind of more of like a, a pink texture. It's very light. I could go in and actually change the emission to make it brighter, but I wanted the player to come into this game and not see kind of this bright texture right off the bat. But you can see here, I can adjust it and, and make it kind of this really bright, cool, vibrant looking crystal. And maybe I'll have it glow over time. But the idea here is, is to have the character, um, the ship come into the the game and and kind of know that there's something on this asteroid there's some kind of silicate like a cosmic silicate that maybe they're after or they're investigating and so they're they're coming in here but you know the first one they see maybe it's darker maybe they don't see kind of this brighter one right off the bat so then i have this other one here that you know is kind of more rich more green anyway um the way that i did this uh with those two obviously is, is i took them into the terrain editor and I said, I just want to kind of paint these on. And so I uploaded them as trees, actually. I said, instead of painting trees on the terrain in the Unity Terrain Editor, I want to paint these um, as as crystals instead. So that's all I did. Uh, you know, I went in, I zoomed out, and I, I, I threw them into the Terrain Editor. And uh, as I started flying around here, I said, ah, I'll take some crystals here. And you can kind of zoom in and see um, the crystals that we added right there. They're blue if, if you're further away, they kind of have this level of detail. And so that's something that I got to edit there too. But really neat to just be able to add detail to it. You can also do it not just from the trees on the side here, but I also did paint detail. And if you go down to uh, the brush I did, it might have taken it off. I might have, I might have redid it. Um, but anyways, you can add a detail control here by going to this list, adding a detailed mesh, and then it pops open this mesh here, which you can add this kind of crystal game object to it and say, I want to paint that game object into the scene itself as detail on the terrain. So super cool. Love that ability. I'm going to continue playing with it and, and kind of make this asteroid feel more alive, feel more rich and, and give the player a reason to come here and investigate it. So that's it for today. I'll see you tomorrow.